In today's video, I will teach you how to remove the background in GIMP. Let's get started. A typical computer picture is made up of three color channels, red, green, and blue. Each channel is simply a grayscale image, but depending on which channel it represents, white pixels are shown as the channel color and are merged to form a regular image. To add transparency to your image, you must include the fourth channel, known as the alpha channel. Alpha channels are also grayscale pictures, but instead of representing red, green, or blue pixels, any white pixels included inside them are viewed as transparent. So, before you remove the background of your image, go to the menu bar, go to Layer, Transparency, and add Alpha Channel. If the option is grayed out, your image is already an Alpha Channel. Because transparency is key to how layer compositing works, Alpha Channels are automatically formed when you add several layers to a picture. To finally remove the background of your image, we will use the Fuzzy Select tool. Go to the toolbar and select the Fuzzy Select tool, or simply use the shortcut key U to quickly switch the Fuzzy Select tool. Fuzzy Select tool automatically selects all pixels within a specific color range of the first color that you clicked on. This tool works best on a plain background, but this tool is still very useful in more complex backgrounds. Let's start with this one. Once you switch to the Fuzzy Select tool, simply click on the background of your image. If you want to add another selection to the current one, you can hold the Shift key and click on the area that you would like to add to your selection. To remove selection, you can simply hold down the Control key on your keyboard and click on the areas that you would like to be select. Now, simply press the Delete key on your keyboard to delete the background. Now, for this more complex background, we can repeat the same steps that this is going to be more time-consuming. This time, since we're dealing with a lot of colors, we can adjust the threshold value. If the color that you would like to select is pretty much similar to the color surrounding it, or if the color takes up a lot of space, you can increase the threshold to select more areas in just one click. But if you would like to select an area with tons of different colors, you must bring down the threshold and take your time selecting in this area. To clean up the edges, you can switch to the eraser tool or simply press Shift-D on your keyboard. Now you know how to remove background in GIMP. If you find this video helpful, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. And if you want to see more tutorials, turn on the notification bell to get notified whenever we upload new videos.